Hi and welcome to How Do I Housewife? Today we're going to be, do some cooking because I need to eat. We're going to be cooking some kind of alfredo from scratch. Have a recipe so this will be fun. The first step is to get your meat out, which I chose this ooh, Italian sausage, and get that out to thaw because I would have made this video yesterday if anything would have been out to thaw. The first thing you're going to do is get a pan, put your thing on, I don't know, seven. You're going to cook your sausage first, so let your pan heat up a little bit. Daydream. Oh, it's sizzling. Do you hear it? Do you hear the sizzle? Okay, so now it's a little hot. We're going to um, drop some sausage in. I don't really know how much. It's just for me and my husband. So I'll put three sausages in. And then you just kind of bludgeon them to kind of cut them in part. This is a bad idea. I should have cut this before. Oh, there we go. It's coming out of this shell. Oh, this is gross. No self, please cut this before you get going. Instead of thinking you could cut it in the pan. Ew. 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 I didn't cut it. <laughs> what is the idea? Now that it looks completely mutilated and unedible, cook the sausage up. Oh, it's making noises. It's all over my hand. See that good people? I'm very sure I just almost started my burner on fire. So now your Italian sausage is almost cooked. Turn down the burner, add some cream cheese. Mix the cream cheese around. Oh, it's burning a little. Turn it way down because obviously it's burning. Add a little bit of half and half. Or milk if you're not low carbing. Oh, it's so hot. See how much it's bubbling? Look at that. That's crazy. Okay, so now you have a cream cheese half and half and Italian sausage sauce. I'm going to add shaker parmesan cheese because the real stuff is too expensive. I add quite a bit because I like cheese. Oops. That was hot. Ow, 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 ow. Now that it looks kind of cooked, I'm going to put a little bit of mozzarella. I know mozzarella makes it all gunky and fun, but I like the flavor, so... I don't care what you think. So stir that in. Now, you forgot to put the broccoli in a pan. Since uh, we're low carbing right now, which means you don't eat uh, as many carbs, you eat more things like protein and vegetables, I'm going to use broccoli instead of pasta. Pasta is carbs. You're going to turn on the one that one, and pour enough broccoli to eat. What the heck is that? That's not broccoli. That looks like a green bean. That's probably enough broccoli. I use, oh, I hate everything. So you turn that on, get a different spoon because your other one's covered. Once again, wooden spoons are the only way to go. And you just kind of let that cook. Back to your sauce. Now it looks like a bunch of cheese instead of sauce, you know you shouldn't have added the mozzarella. Oh well. Now you're going to flavor it like something that tastes Italian. I flavor everything with onion powder. I left my onion powder out so now it's all like congealed. Garlic powder. Pepper. Pepper's gonna pep. Pepper's gonna pep. I like to add paprika because it looks pretty. Good enough. No, it kind of looks like that. Ooh, pretty colors. You might need to add a little bit more liquid because the cheese kind of took over. Broccoli. There's way too many things going on at once. I always add, oh, I add salt sometimes. Where's my salt? Where's the salt? Oh, there it is. I it right in front of my face. So you're going to add some salt. Good enough. I'm going to add basil. Oregano, because they sound Italian. Good job. Oh, my broccoli is starting to make scary noises, which means it's probably burning. It's still frozen. You're going to 
add a little bit more half and half because it looks like it's very thick. So here's the finished Alfredo. It looks like that. Mm, it tastes really good. I might sneeze. <coughs> good enough. This is done, so you're just going to turn it off and hope that it doesn't burn because you're not mixing it. So hot in here. So what did you do this weekend? Broccoli's never gonna cook. It's still like frozen. My hair do. It looks like I'm from Frozen. See? I've been touched. Look at this. Oh, this side. Broccoli takes forever to cook. I thought, thought it would be the easy part of this, but apparently not. Wash well, it with butter in it. I know it tastes like noodles. <laughs> Mix it around in there. I'm not really looking this. Oh, it was cold instead of hot. I thought it was gonna be hot. I look good, I think. Do this look good? Ow, ow, it was actually hot that time. Okay, so now that your broccoli's done, you're gonna serve two plates. Paper plates mean I don't wanna do dishes today because I already did all my dishes. Ew, what is that? That looks gross. You scoop some broccoli. On your plate like it's noodles. Take some of this and you put it right on top. Then you top it with some Parmesan cheese. It <coughs> you choke to death. It's beautiful. Definitely restaurant style quality. Thank you for watching How Do I Housewife? Give a comment and a like and a share and all those things. That doesn't make any sense. A comment. Tell me what you would like me to do next. I have some great suggestions. I just gotta get them going. Subscribe. I have 26 subscribers now. Yeah. All right. Thank you for watching. Bye. This is our food. I can't eat with my. I have no way of doing this. Go ahead. You take a bite. You're lefty. You tell me if it's good. Oh yeah, that's really good. Is that? Mm-hmm. Mm. Thank you. Bye.